110 days. That's how long it took China to build one of the most complex underground tunnels in its history. This is the Jinan Huanggang Tunnel, a 5.7 kilometer, six lane underground highway, stretching 30 meters below the mighty Yellow River. With a diameter of 17.5 meters, it's among the largest and deepest river tunnels ever built in China. While most tunnels of this scale take years to complete, this one was built in just 110 days. That's less than four months to complete an underwater tunnel beneath one of the world's most powerful and unpredictable rivers. So how did China build one of the world's most complex tunnels in record time? And that too without a single major failure. This is the incredible story of the Jinan Huanggang Tunnel, which was built within just 110 days. This one-of-a-kind mega-project is built in the city of Jinan, also known as the City of Springs. It's a place where ancient temples stand beside modern skyscrapers. Here, the streets buzz with life, while the mighty Yellow River flows through its heart. This river has shaped the city's history, but it's also divided it in half. For decades, crossing from one side of Jinan to the other meant traffic jams, overcrowded ferries, and endless delays. And as the city grew, so did its problems. Something had to change. That's when China decided to do the impossible, build a highway right beneath the Yellow River. But this wasn't just any river. The Yellow River is notoriously unstable, with a constantly shifting riverbed made of sand, clay, and silt. At 30 meters deep, the force of the water is enough to flood an entire tunnel in seconds if anything goes wrong. But engineers weren't just digging a tunnel, they were racing against time. The tunnel had to be built fast, efficiently, and most importantly, without failure. And to turn this mega project into reality, China came up with a 5,200-ton beast, the Shanghai Shield Machine. This behemoth was engineered specifically for this mission. This wasn't just a tunnel borer. It was a full-blown underground factory, chewing through the earth without a single break. At 17 and a half meters wide, the TBM chewed through rock and sediment 24-7 while crews follow closely behind installing reinforced concrete segments in real time. The machine constantly monitored soil pressure, water levels, and ground conditions, adjusting as it dug to ensure absolute stability. To make this work, massive prefabricated concrete segments were cast off-site, transported, and installed immediately as the machine advanced. This had to be executed with flawless precision. The TBM had to dig through tens of thousands of cubic meters of earth, navigating 30 meters beneath a shifting, unpredictable riverbed, all while maintaining absolute stability. Every hour counted, every millimeter had to be precise, because one mistake could flood the entire tunnel. On December 19th, 2024, just 110 days after the first dig, the underwater section of the Jinan Huanggang Tunnel was completed. The final tunnel segments were locked into place, the last meters of excavation cleared, and the TBM had done its job flawlessly. No major setbacks, no catastrophic failures, just precision, speed, and engineering at its absolute finest. And when those first vehicles finally rolled through, what they were driving into wasn't just a tunnel. It was a megastructure unlike anything Jinan had ever seen. At 5.7 kilometers long, with a staggering 17.5 meter diameter, the Jinan Huanggang Tunnel had finally become one of the largest and deepest river tunnels ever built in China. To put it into perspective, this isn't one of those tight tunnels where cars are stuck in a single file. It's an incredible two-level highway built underground, with three lanes going north and three going south. And just for comparison, the Channel Tunnel between the UK and France, which is considered to be one of the most famous underwater tunnels in the world, has a diameter of just 7.6 meters, whereas the Jinan Huanggang Tunnel is more than twice that size. But size alone doesn't make this a masterpiece. 
every detail of this tunnel was designed for speed, efficiency, and safety. Vehicles can cruise through at 60 kilometers an hour or 37 miles per hour, turning what used to be an hour-long gridlock into a smooth five-minute drive. And with its double-deck structure, it's not just about moving cars. It's about keeping traffic flowing perfectly, even during peak hours. And of course, when you build something this massive, safety is everything. So what's stopping thousands of tons of river water from crashing in? Well, that's where the tunnel's engineering brilliance comes in. The Jinan Wangang Tunnel is built like a fortress, where every single detail was designed to withstand extreme conditions, from shifting riverbeds to the crushing way to the water above. The walls are made of massive prefabricated concrete segments, each weighing dozens of tons, locked together like a giant puzzle. They're designed to distribute pressure perfectly, ensuring that even if the river shifts, the tunnel stays intact. And then there's the waterproofing. At this depth, groundwater pressure reaches 7.5 bar, enough to flood an entire tunnel in seconds if even a minor leak occurred. But thanks to multi-layered sealing systems, combined with the adaptive pressure control of the TBM, water stays out while traffic moves seamlessly inside. And let's say a leak does happen. The tunnel is equipped with state-of-the-art drainage systems and emergency shutoff barriers that can seal off sections instantly, preventing disasters before they even begin. Keeping the water out was one challenge, but keeping thousands of vehicles moving safely inside, well, that's another story. When you build a 5.7 kilometer long double-decker highway buried under a river, you can't just rely on basic ventilation and some road signs. You need a system that thinks ahead and reacts instantly. That's why the Jinan Huanggang Tunnel is packed with next-gen safety features designed to handle traffic flow, fire hazards, air quality, and emergency responses in real time. First up, ventilation. Any tunnel this long needs powerful airflow systems to keep exhaust fumes from building up. But this one takes it even further. Smart sensors constantly monitor air quality, adjusting the massive ventilation fans in real time to keep conditions perfect for drivers. And then there's fire safety. If a fire ever breaks out inside, the tunnel's automatic fire suppression systems kick in instantly. High pressure sprinklers, emergency exits, and fire resistant escape routes are built into the structure, ensuring that if the unthinkable happens, people have a way out and fast. And perhaps the most futuristic feature is the tunnel's AI-driven monitoring system. Dozens of high-speed cameras and motion sensors track every vehicle inside the tunnel. If there's a crash, a breakdown, or even a sudden stop, the system detects it immediately and alerts traffic control, adjusting signals and guiding emergency response teams in seconds. In the end, the Jinan Wanggang Tunnel is more than concrete and steel. It's a demonstration of groundbreaking engineering and sheer human will. In just 110 days, China carved a path through one of the toughest natural obstacles on Earth, making this project a constant reminder that the future of infrastructure isn't waiting to be built. It's already here.